Hello everyone, and this is the video about interior permanent magnet synchronous machine propelling a simplified axle drive electric vehicle. Here, uh, this is the example also uh, to plot the torque of uh, electric vehicle and also uh, some uh, vehicle control subsystems and drive controller and what are the inputs and the electric drives and vehicle dynamics are uh, incorporated here. Here, uh, this type of uh, method here this is the input builder that is a by using a signal builder we can um, uh, build our uh, acceleration and brake um, brake and incline and wind based the best on that we can modify here this is our value here also whatever your value we can uh, easily uh, we are give your own inputs and all uh, otherwise we can import uh, from file and after uh, after this one we can export this data also it is possible here also we can print this uh, signal builder block by using this uh, interactive signal builder app here itself we can rename your axis axis time and uh, we can set this um, set by snap grid and the set by display limit and also it is possible you can change the colors you can change the li uh, line limits line width al and also it is possible by just by clicking we can uh, this is the uh, first one the acceleration and brake command and incline and wind command were uh, displayed here by using the signal builder we can uh, give the inputs then um, after uh, giving this applying the inputs the vehicle controller uh, subsystem it is in this uh, sub, uh, vehicle controller subsystem converts the drive inputs uh, into a relevant uh, torque command here it is all the inputs here this vehicle controller also having uh, this acceleration pedal brake pedal and also velocity acceleration pedal characteristics curve uh, block and brake brake pedal characteristic block also it is useful here here then uh, this is the drive controller block drive controller subsystems this drive controller subsystem uh, it is controls and uh, the torque of the interior permanent uh, synchronous machine and uh, this is all the inputs these are the blocks are uh, used here uh, by using uh, this controller this measurement blocks outer loop control and current control and task uh, scheduler and also incorporated here this is a task scheduler have has the flow chart that is a state flow flow chart it also applying by using this this kind of state flow method here then uh, that is our uh, uh, pm ipm sm uh, electric drive here uh, in this uh, drive circuit has uh, some measurement units gear driver unit and sensor unit here this type of converters that is a IGPT based converters uh, involved here here also you can switching device you can uh, change uh, modify modify here but, but based on your requirement um, it is some options are available here GTO ideal semiconductor switch and the IGPT MOSFET thyristor average switch here in this example we are using IGPT based uh, switching device here also uh, you can you can describe as forward voltage 0.8 and non-state resistance and off-state resistance and threshold voltage yourself you can uh, use to here here uh, integral di diodes that is the integral protection diode protection diode with no dynamics here here no sub uh, number uh, circuits otherwise the one more option is rc number in this example you know you don't have any uh, any other rc circuit so that uh, you can use this type of uh, converter that is a three-phase converter this block uh, represent a six pulse uh, uh, th three phase control converter consisting of three bridging offs of uh, uh, switching devices here then finally this is a vehicle dynamic systems and this is a gearbox a gearbox block it is derived from this vehicle dynamics block set <coughs> this block generates uh, torque in positive direction if you positive torque applied applied to the input shaft and the ratio is assigned a positive value here uh, this is already you know very well about this uh, vehicle dynamics in this vehicle dynamics there is a braking command and gravity and the wind speed and drag inputs are uh, multiplexed here it is a uh, vehicle mass subsystems also uh, utilized here we have wheel and axle drive subsystem these are all uh, derived from uh, taken from uh, vehicle block set that is a vehicle dynamics block set uh, library simulic library it is a example used to plot uh, torque of electric vehicle and also uh, we can use this uh, ssc explore that is a um, interactive app in uh, matlab Simlink. Also, we can uh, modify the model parameters also by using this example. Um, uh, particularly, this example shows an interior permanent magnet synchronous machine propelling a simplified um, axle drive electric vehicle. Here, more number of uh, options are available here in this example. 
uh, that's uh, you can measure uh, rotor mechanical velocity and also uh, phase currents uh, dc link voltage and rot rotor electric um, angle <coughs> reference and real dc axis current and also uh, reference and real q axis uh, current and finally the what are the requirements there is a main requirements of vehicle speed and drive inputs and power and the power calculations uh, mean uh, pwm enable and also stator uh, voltages that is vdq all this uh, all these are uh, possible here by using this command uh, first you run uh, afterwards you will check out this um, outputs particularly this type of uh, uh, examples um, it's a simplified model of axle drive uh, some some uh, somebody ha has this type of error means just you go to uh, this one this one you change this direct working directly now you, you can simulate you, you you have no errors um, there is a axle drive uh, electric vehicle simplified model it also you can use uh, by this IP MSM uh, tar control uh, in an um, electric drive, axle uh, drive, electric uh, drive. Here it is a uh, simulation time, you can fix it as uh, 5 uh, so that we can get this uh, outputs uh, in this manner. There is a um, measured vehicle speed and drive inputs and also power, all the things you can. Apparently, you can uh, see at the time of simulation. This is a sample based uh, input here. Sample based uh, simulation is going on now. And also, we can see the power calculation PWM and uh, VDQ. Also need that is a zero order volt. That is a ZOH block uh, enable that is a phase currents and uh, DC uh, link voltages. Also we can see rotor electrical angle. You can see the rotor electrical angle and also measure the mechanical rotor mechanical velocity. It is also possible. Uh, so that in this kind of uh, outputs you can see. Uh, also, you can analyze this um, RPM and the speed, uh, vehicle speed, all things are possible. That is for phase current, that is for VDQ, that is a stator uh, DQ voltage here, that is a theta value. Another uh, is for uh, uh, drive inputs. This acceleration brake. And also this one RPM value. In this manner we can analyze the um, uh, scope outputs different types of co scope outputs you can see the uh, stator uh, uh, dq voltages and acceleration and brake commands that is a drive inputs and uh, what is the outputs all the things you can uh, analyze by using this uh, scopes many number of scopes are used to uh, measure this axle drive measure and uh, analyze this axle drive uh, ev that is a ipm uh, uh, some torque control block then now finally you can uh, uh, plot the torque of electric vehicle here itself we can uh, say the see the matlab script code um, based on that we can um, change the parameters change the values um, also we uh, we can measure and estimated reference li limits uh, that is uh, a graph plot between is like torque versus time and also current versus time that is a phase current and uh, motor torque torque you can analyze based on this one we can analyze in this tool what is the xy xy limits and that is measured and estimated the dot line shows the limits and uh, 
uh, uh, this blue color uh, was the measured value. By using this uh, interactive uh, SSC Explorer, we can uh, see the simulation result in, uh, in block by block. In each, each block, you can analyze the battery, charge on the cycles, power dissipated, and it is your electric vehicle converter, electric reference, that is a gate driver, block output, that is IPS, IPM, is some angular position. All the things are possible here. You can see the um, angular position and the angular velocity, all type of outputs and all type of measurements you can see, current, the current and star value. This is a mechanical rotation is for reference and this is your vehicle dynamics uh, block. In this block, you can measure the force source and um, what is the sensor vehicle speed and vehicle mass, v, um, wheel and axle. This so that you can uh, analyze uh, accurately by using this example. Also, you can see the uh, user-friendly user codes. These codes are uh, to plot the simulation result from uh, this particular model. Just you type uh, this command in this uh, command window, we can get this example. Okay. Uh, based on that, you can uh, ch change the values, change the parameters, you can get this output like this. Uh, then also we can able to modify the model parameters by using this one here. Here itself you can modify the parameters like maximum power and maximum torque and stata d axis and um, q axis inductance and stata zero is sequence inductance. These are also possible. But it is a PMS some flux linkage also you can modify. These are the model parameters you can modify for your research for your uh, uh, um, for, for, for your convenient way, for your task, uh, that is your task is dealing uh, for the control is implemented in a state flow um, uh, state machine. Uh, here also some, some uh, scopes of systems are used to allow you to see the simulation results here. Here after that we can change the parameter just to save and run, we will get this output like this. You can also analyze the parameters, you, know, you can change the uh, flex in, uh, para model parameters, you can uh, see the outputs by using this. Is particularly these examples uh, shows the IPM SM torque control. Uh, that is the IPSM um, IPM SM uh, propelling a simplified axle drive electric vehicle. Thanks for watching. Uh, this is where you, uh, you are first watching our uh, video means just to subscribe my channel and also support my channel. If there is any queries, uh, give the commands. Uh, in this uh, description section, I will give this uh, model for your reference. Thank you. Thank you so much.